Good evening, YouTubers. New Time Travel Jaime 88 here, and welcome back to my YouTube video vlog for Monday night, June 20th, 2016. And I gotta tell you, it is so darn hot. Yes, here in Baltimore, Maryland. Earlier, the temperature is 93 degrees, and I'm, I know. I was working at my workplace, I was starting to sweat. And that's why I feel overheated today. So I went, took a break, and drank some water to help me cool down. <laughs> so um, if I know because the heat will be going away soon because tomorrow a chance of showers and thunderstorms is coming all day so that will help knock down the temperature and the heat and humidity all right guys as you remember today is the first full day of summer summer begins at 6 5 a.m. and I know um, Baltimore City Schools um, last day of school is tomorrow I know County Baltimore County School already had their last day left closed out last week. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to that summer, not to uh, summer humidity, because I don't want to see any more the, the 100 temperature mark. Anyway, um, the other night, I... Finish, I just finished watching the Field of Dreams on VHS. Sorry about that. That's my um, text, my um, YouTube, I mean, my Facebook message. Or I'll get that a little bit. But as what I'm saying, um, here's the VHS of Field of Dreams. It's a very good movie. And I highly recommend it. And if you haven't got your copy of Field of Dreams, I highly recommend it. You might find it on eBay, Amazon.com, or go to your local thrift store. It's the front, spine, upper spine, top and the back. Mm -hmm. Also, I still have the, the 1990 VHS sealed up still a factory seal I got it at Savers I'm gonna keep it sealed because it's a very treasure tape okay and this is a very good film by the way I want to welcome Dominique Stewart to the to YouTube welcome aboard Dominique and I'm glad you like my videos and thank you very much for commenting on my videos I very appreciate it anyway um just let you know that um there's gonna be making a um a lethal weapon TV series and no it will not be starring Mel Gibson and Danny Glover uh -uh, because um, because they are they're uh, they're too old so it's a a series this is this movie stars Clay Crawford and Damon Wayans so it's, it's loosely based off the same name from from the movie and it's based on the lethal weapon series mm. and also I just watched the um, the trailer for time after time a new series that will be hitting airways on ABC this fall I cannot wait to see this brand new TV series and um, I'm gonna see how much I like the film 
or not, I mean, the, I mean not the film, but the TV series. So, yeah. Um, if you haven't seen it, check it out. Well, I was still shocked yesterday because after the, the, the passing of Star Trek star Anton Yelchin, I was at the, um, waiting for the bus and then my mom texts me and tell me that Anton Yelchin died, had passed away and I was kind of heartbroken. I know Star Trek, a lot of Star Trek fans are, are in tears right now because the recent passing, uh, he's a, a great guy, Anton Yelchin's a great kid, did a wonderful job. Um, also, on while um, Zoe Saldana um, celebrated her birthday on uh, yesterday, and she was shocked and sad and was devastated, and she wrote this on Twitter. Devastated by our friend's loss, we are mourning his passing and celebrate the beautiful spirit that he was. Hashtag rest in peace Anton. That she was in Cuba, she learned when Zoe Saldana, she was in Cuba yesterday and she was learned this, um, the news of, of Zoe Sand, of Anton Yelchin. So, thoughts and prayers goes out to Anton Yelchin's family and colleague. And, man, I, I know because there's so many Star Trek stars and actors that we lost from the 90s to today. Um, you know, in the eight, I forgot the 80s, uh, Roger C. Carmel played Harry Mudd passed away in 1986. Um, we lost Gene Rottenberry, the creator of Star Trek in 1991. Um, D4, we lost B.B. Beach in 96. Then later in the year, Mark Leonard, November of 96. Then DeForest Kelly died June 11th, 1999. James Dewan, uh July 22nd, 2015. I mean, 2005. Major Barrett Rottenberry um, passed away in summer 2009, I guess, I think. And um, Leonard Nimoy passed away in 2015. And, and also um, William Schaller, who played Niels Barris in Star Trek, also uh, passed away. Uh, I think that's pretty much it of this and I was still shocked and uh, from yesterday and and I, I watched um, Star Trek 2009 reboot yesterday to honor to remember him so I'm gonna watch um, Terminator Salvation tomorrow and Star Trek Into Darkness and I also have Odd Thomas on DVD so I will watch them as well um, if you haven't seen um, Finding Dory yet but go check it out it's still number one it broke opening weekend yesterday we celebrating Superman's 35th anniversary yes the movie released June 19th, 1981. And if you want to check out Superman Montage, then check it out on um, on Facebook. That's right. Facebook at Superman M the Movies. Yeah. 
Oh, excuse me, I'm so exhausted. So I'm gonna go film, upload it, put it on YouTube, and now hit the A. I mean, hit the hey. So um. Anyway, tomorrow's gonna be another great day. All right, guys, that's it for my tonight's video vlog. Shout out goes to Dominic Stewart. All right, guys. I mean Dominique. Dominique Stewart. If you want to shout out my next video, comment below tell me what are you going to do for 4th of July. Till next time, New Time Travel Jaime 88. Good night. Have a pleasant tomorrow. I'm going to rewatch this movie again. Oh yeah. On Wednesday.